Hi, Fire Signs. Welcome back to Self Discovery Support. That's Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. Yeah, we're going to be doing a reading for you. Um, what's happening right now? What is going on in your energy? And we're starting off. I want you know. I I want to use something a little bit more fun, less depressing. <laughs> we have had some depressing messages recently, and I just want to see um, what's what's going on. How's your energy? And letting you know what messages come through. So do go ahead and subscribe if you like um, my messages. And also, at the end, we'll draw an oracle card for you. Alright, so let's get started. We have, I'm using the BuzzFeed oracle. And we have Saturday morning cartoons, gel pens, and corporate blue, hidden energies, bison. So, I feel like for you guys, there is there is a lot of, I feel like there's a lot of memories being triggered at this moment. Yeah, I do feel that there is, and you're moving, I see the energy shifting from a more carefree attitude, a more lighthearted attitude. But realizing that there is something that you envision for yourself in the future, there is something that you see. And you realize that it might need a little bit of a different approach. Yeah. Um, so you're not you're not approaching something in this kind of light, kind of go happy go lucky, carefree way anymore. You're understanding. There is a kind of understanding that's happening about how one needs to approach something. Being a little bit more serious, being a little bit more um, focused, directed, and with a bison, it's like a very practical approach, right? But right under that is um, there's a lot of love. Yeah, there's a lot of there's a there's like a beating heart under this. There is um, there's something that you want to get right. I do see that with a double tap pink. Um, yeah. So, hmm, I, I feel that because we have these two cards, this talks about memories of something, something that you, or there's a lot of kind of thought about something. You know, we're, we're thinking about, or we're, we're envisioning what we want and we, where we want to be and almost getting ourselves into an energy to be ready to approach it. I want to find out what you're approaching. I also see that some of you could be um, moving from moving up in your career. You know, there could be um, promotions involved. You could be, yeah, there could be a need to to take something seriously in profession, and also, yeah, in life. It's. I want to see what is what is caused. <laughs> What else is going on for fire signs that's caused this kind of change in in um in energy? The hierophant, okay. What else? Six of Wands. What else? Ten of Coins. Five of Coins in hidden energy. Okay. So I feel like let's talk about the, the career and the money first. And I'm going to talk about um, the love here. But Five of Coins does tell me that you did feel. There's a feeling of not having enough. There's a feeling of just not being able to make ends meet in certain ways. There's a, a dream that you probably... There's a feeling of lack, right? You're, you're aware that there's something you wanted which you are away from. You're not receiving in the ways that you want um so in in money it could be you know st you're just not getting that promotion you're not moving up you're not expanding in the career the way you want or you're just not adding to you're not going up in the scale in the salary the way that you want um it's just not working out and so that has been a shock that really helps me understand this this oracle message that we have up here of you really realizing that, okay, what I need to do is level things up in certain ways. Um, the Hierophant, it's 
So I feel like there's there's some kind of mentorship or maybe some of you went back to school. Some of you went to to in order to pursue the moving up, the moving on. Some of you have gone back to school. Some of you have taken on mentors and advisors, maybe someone at work, a colleague, just someone who you look up to. And even also some of you have even received guidance from elders even spiritual guidance you know you've gone to wherever it is that you get your spiritual wisdom from you've gone there because what you want to do is you want to be successful you want to lead right this is true um fire sign energy you want to move ahead which is fair you know that's totally fair ten of coins um you you want to move up and you like this is i mean this is firm confirmation with the five of coins and the ten of coins this is what your eye is on but this is what you felt you were experiencing right what a contrast and then with the page of coins right under that tells me that yeah you you decided i have to i have to figure out how to make this better i have to figure out how to move myself from this place of scarcity to this place of abundance to this place of security and yeah you decide okay this has things have to change now things really have to change with that death card there and so i feel that a lot of you are in this transition period where you're moving ahead um you really have your eye on changing the circumstances um all right so let's let's look at it in relation to love so the hierophant here does talk about higher level um, commitments and contracts, can talk about marriage, can talk about someone you are married to, someone you want to be married to as well. Um, there's a sense that you want to have success with someone. There's a sense that you see a long term with this person. You are, it's almost like I have found the person I have spotted, I am aware, I'm not joking at this point now, I need to level up in certain ways or I need to align certain things, I need to factor in, think about certain things because what I want is actually serious now. I see that my hopes and dreams lay in a certain situation and the fact that you have the five of coins, for those of us in this talking about love, is yeah this i feel that this person you are away from this person you you may not be in communication with this person you may not be talking to this person um yeah there's some message you could be dealing with an earth sign well yeah we have a lot of earth energy here and if it's not earth energy it's fire energy so it's your energy and with the bison here, it's like you are almost adopting that earth energy. Oh wow. Someone is someone is sparking off a transition in you, fire signs. There's some apology, some message that needs to be sent. Because if you don't, it's like something's going to end. I feel like you feel the urgency that something's ending here and you don't want to miss out. You do have a lot of love. You're in your water energy. This could be someone else. King of Cups, Three of Swords. Uh, some, some, someone that you really did feel a lot of emotion for. Maybe you didn't speak the words. Maybe you never expressed to them, I love you. I care a lot for you. But you did feel that pain. You did feel that deeply. Yeah, there was some there there was an emotional situation here with someone that I think that this ending really shook you up. This tower here tells me that with the King of Cups, the Three of Swords, the Tower, it's a major um emotional situation which causes pain and completely shifts things. Seven of Swords here does tell me that you you didn't trust this completely this something happened here and sent you completely into a space of distrust Ooh, that's heavy like these three cards are heavy i feel that knight of swords coming through okay so now 
No. Now you're forming a plan. Now you're deciding, okay, I feel that this has been some time. The towel. Okay, you're, rea you're realizing the importance of something and you want to rush in to... If this is not you, this could be someone else, right? We do have... Um, yeah, this could be someone who's coming towards you as well, wanting to communicate. They see you as the emperor or this person is the emperor. Is the person is your your counterpart. This person is someone that you see, uh, king of wands. That's your fire sign energy. I don't know why I feel that. Look at that. The lovers underneath that. I'm just going to show you this. The emperor comes up first, right? So... I feel this is you taking charge. I'm not gonna lie, fire signs. This looks like your energy, King of Wands, right under that. Getting into your own like sense of self. This is your element. This is you gathering your power, your your courage, your worth. Getting yourself together, preparing for something. And what is that something? Is this love that is calling you back in? There is someone in your energy. Um, if the, if some of you are not dealing with are not dealing with love at this moment, we do have that career segment that that applies. But this is so heavily someone here. Um, if you're with this person already, it could just be that there's a, you know there's a disagreement, there is a rift. You now feel that you want to give to something. You're fully motivated to give to something because I think you want to create a sense of stability in this. A lot of earth energy, so much, and it's earth and fire. There's some air energy and some water energy, but I feel that it's almost like the we see you going through these phases of getting in touch with the emotions, feeling the emotions understanding the change that needs to happen and then saying okay i'm gonna i'm gonna really put myself together i'm gonna strategize how i can move forward because this time i'm gonna show up as the emperor this time i'm gonna show up as the king of wands because this time i understand that there is something really important here that i i do want to i do want to have us in a mutual situation and I don't want to let this go okay um yeah that was uh that was pretty intense it's I do feel it like the intense fire energy so I do that's why I'm saying I feel it's your energy but if this is your person your person is also fired up about this um let me just grab one on how how the fire signs person is feeling about this i haven't done this for any of the other signs but i feel like you guys need it the world nine of swords i feel that your person could be worried that this is over yeah i think that this particular world card really helps me to think that it's a couple coming full completion full and come by completion i mean they've come full circle there's a lot that you've gone through you've gone through a whole cycle this tells me your person feels that maybe it's time to close this cycle and start anew this card is almost like the lover's card right it is a love which has seen through difficulties and come into a new phase. There's some kind of success which has been had. Nine of Swords. I think your person is a little bit worried if this will actually come together. I feel that, yeah, I think she's, well, this this person here, what did I say she? Okay, could be um, a feminine energy here, but it couldn't, it doesn't have to be. Yeah, I think your person thinks that maybe you will not be able to decide on them. Maybe, maybe you can't decide if this this connection makes you happy. Maybe your person also is also... Um, I do see satisfaction. Like, 
your person has a lot of feelings underneath a lot of thought oh my god your person is is covered in thought and thinking and worry and that is clouding out the fact that they actually do want this um but i think they feel that maybe you would you are not going to make amends um so that makes me feel like the i'm gonna worry and thought i'm seeing is it makes me feel like you're not in contact with this person yeah all right so i want to get a oracle message for you what is the message for fire signs Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Each time I choose to tune into spirit guidance, spirit, guidance of the highest truth shows up for me. Yeah, I feel so. Um, with the Hierophant here, that does tell me that you're being guided forward. And it does tell me that that has already started because I do see the shift in energy you starting to move from a place of treating something a little bit more lightly carefree and really planning out what you want to happen and going towards a more serious practical approach here so that is it for you fire signs if you enjoyed this please do subscribe and i'll see you again for more let me know how it goes out for you in the comments take care